I would like to progress in the discussion on cutting oil imports from Russia. As Europe tries to reduce its dependence on Russian oil, the U.S. is working to reduce gas prices. The White House's latest idea involves an emergency waiver from the Environmental Protection Agency to allow year-round sales of 15 percent ethanol blend gasoline. Even though E15 is only available in a few thousand pumps today, we're investing more than $100 million to build biofuel infrastructure of the future. Things like blend pump, blender pumps. Ethanol comes from plants like corn, so its biggest advantage is price. Experts say E15 gas could be up to 10 cents a gallon cheaper than regular fuel right now. But the EPA has a reason for capping ethanol content at 10 percent during the summer. It creates more smog than normal gas because it evaporates faster and reacts with sunlight. Summer weather can make that worse. Ozone smog isn't just an environmental problem. It's also a health concern. It can cause breathing issues for groups such as seniors, people with respiratory issues and outdoor workers. Some Republicans say broader action is needed to really lower gas prices. We can be energy independent again. The administration needs to take the shackles off of domestic production. One of the advantages of being vice president is I get to drive my own car again. <laughs> One of the disadvantages is I get to pay for my own gas. Charlotte McBride, WUSA 9.